Every pregnancy needs utmost care and attention. But certain pregnancies need a little extra attention. An RH negative mother carrying an RH positive baby is at increased risk of complications. BSV is at the forefront to ensure safe delivery in every RH negative pregnancy. Uh, quite an emotional day as well for a lot of the Australians, particularly. And for someone like Alana, she also sort of indicated uh, and paid homage to uh, someone like Shane Wan. But Julia, uh, fantastic from a youngster there. She was a tad disappointed at the way her, oh, her spell ended, uh, but a great effort nevertheless. Yeah, yeah, she showed a lot of courage. I thought she still kept throwing the ball up there. Probably just didn't get her fields exactly right. She wanted to keep that long on back instead of a, a long off. Or potentially even both. Um, yeah, and, and again, didn't have a slip in early for Dunkley. She was turning it a lot. So I, I really thought she probably could have had that slip in. And, and then, of course, there was that bowling change by Meg Lenning, which fortunately she reversed and um, brought the, another bowler on for, for one over and then realised that she'd made a mistake and <laughs> put uh, Alana King back on. So, you know, with those little disruptions, I mean, she copes with it really well. She's uh, quite a mature bowler. Um, but gets nice rip, and it was just really interesting to see how much turn was in this pitch. So that'll be interesting from now on to see how that pitch plays for the rest of the uh, tournament. Yes, um, but Brittany, your thoughts as well on someone like Alana? Um, sort of daunting to be on this world stage for sure. I mean, yes, it's easier, relatively easier, when you have the runs to back, uh, but it is a challenge nevertheless. Uh, Alana King has come forth in the past uh, couple of series. She's taking advantage of the opportunity she's getting and she's showing that she's just good as a world-class uh, spinner as all the others like spinners in the world. As we've seen so far in the tournament, it seems like leg, leg spinners is the, the, the bowlers we have to look out for. It seems like they are taking the wicket. The wicket. And tonight, as we see, look, look, Alana King is, was getting a lot of pushes Look at that ball she bowled at uh, Beaumont. It was uh, it was beautiful. Yeah, it was. And another another bowler who, of course, and, and, and a pick for Brit from Brittany, who, who sort of uh, gave that initial breakthrough for Australia was Talia McGrath. Uh, Julia, just a word on how she's sort of grown over the years and what sort of a role she now commands in that lineup. Yeah, she, she started off pretty much as a, as a bowler um, and, and played that role primarily today, obviously not having to bat, but she's become an amazing all-rounder. Uh, she's really had to probably take a lot of the, the responsibility back home in her home state in South Australia and also in her T20 team of strikers. Uh, I think that's really helped develop her very, very quickly and um, they've also eased her into that Australian team, recognised her fairly early that she was going to be this talent. Um, uh, based on you know, her performances and, and just her general skill set. So she's actually got a really good cricket mind as well, captaining down there now in South Australia. And it, and it wouldn't surprise me if they're sort of looking at her for future uh, honours in, in potentially becoming the Australian captain in, in the, the near future. Obviously, Meg's still around. She's only 29. She's still got quite a few more years and clearly still playing pretty well. Um, but, yeah, she's, she might sort of push into that sort of leadership role. Rachel Haynes, obviously, at 35, is probably getting to the back end of her um, uh, her career, despite also performing really well today. Um, but it's nice to have these these young kids coming through who have got such uh, a good head on their shoulders and, and can perform under pressure and, and also have those abilities to, to maybe step up if they need to in the leadership capacity. 